Hey guys, my name is uh, Rob with DK Racing. DK Racing is just a family kart racing team that stands for Dutton Kart Racing. Um, I have three kids that race, and um, I want to go over the, the focus of this video is to go over the Alfano Six and primarily just connecting your iPad Android device with the Alfano Six. I know with uh, iPhone and iPad, we had a little bit of an issue connecting um, an iOS software device with the Alfano 6. Traditionally, you go into your settings menu, click on Bluetooth, and put your device in pairing mode like you would the Alfano 6 by pressing this USB button, and your phone sees the device and you connect to it, and you would think you would go into the software and it would work. It doesn't quite work that easy on the iPad or Android device or the I iPad or iPhone. It does seem to pair that way with an Android device or it did on my son's. But I've tried a handful of uh, um, Apple devices and it didn't work. So with that being said, um, what you do need to do is Download the software, obviously, from the Apple Store. You have to have the software to pair the devices because you pair them through the software. You don't pair them through the phone. So, load up the software. And once you're in the software, um, you could do a bunch of different things and you can connect, you could update your firmware. You can upload a picture. So when your Alfano 6 turns on, it'll show a picture. And um, you can adjust all the settings on your Alfano 6 through here. Um, what we're gonna do just for the sake of it is we're going to go to analysis. And you click on analysis and this is kind of your menu if you have whatever sessions you have loaded onto your phone it shows up here but in the top left corner you see a download button you will hit the download button and once at this point it is searching for a device you will hit usb and the device immediately shows up it's that easy you will then click that with your finger on your phone and it'll um, download all your sessions. I currently do not have any sessions loaded onto my phone because I just wiped my Alfano 6, so I apologize for that because I wanted to show you that. Um, but that's that. And once you go, it'll actually show all your sessions there. You can click what you want to or don't want to download. Um, you pretty much connect your devices, anything or you want to do through the Alfano 6 app, you connect it to your iPhone or iPad through there. And like I said, you can uh, um, download your data, update your firmware, upload a picture. The picture's got to be relatively simple. They just don't look right. Or uh, go through all the settings, and it's much easier adjusting your settings on your Alfano through the app on your um, iPad or um, iOS or Android device. Um, there is a difference in the software, which I will get to, I think, maybe at this point here. Um, there's a little bit of a flaw in the Apple software and again, I've seen this on uh, multiple Apple devices The Android device seems to work, but it is in the setup notes There's a spot in there to put in setup notes. So maybe you're doing a gear change or Rear track width or, or whatever it is um, there's a spot in there to put up setup notes, but the Apple software actually cuts that version off you can see it doesn't look quite finished like the Android version does. You can see you get a little more options there. And um, you click on the little cart icon and you could put in setup changes. Um, I'm assuming, and I have talked to the developer from Alfano 6 for the iOS device, and he was very interested to what was happening. So I'm getting back to him. Just hopefully they can fix this sooner than later. Um, that's really the only major flaw I've seen other than that is just really really cool to, to be able to download your sessions immediately after they come off the truck uh, to come off the track they're in the grid you could walk over there hit that USB button pair them download 
and go back to your, your pit and analyze it from there. Um, really love it. Really love the Alfano 6. The reason why I purchased the Alfano 6 over the Micron 5, and I'm not bashing the Micron 5, they pretty much do the same thing, but the ability to Bluetooth these devices and instantly download your data without any, without just any extra process is just, it's, it's just super cool. And there's probably a bunch of more super cool features I'm starting to discover on the Alfano 6. We'll go over all that a little bit. Anyways, that's it. Wrapping up this video here. Hopefully it doesn't.